What's up guys, Sean here, and I just wanted to film a quick update on Project Pico before I do some uh, cleaning. So, um, Project Pico has kind of been neglected because of some other projects I've been working on. Um, surprisingly, the algae hasn't been as bad on it as I expected, but um, I have had some issues Specifically, the citron clown goby did die, as well as I had a yellow clown goby in there for a second. Um, they both developed um, some sort of ick. So I was able to get them both out and into my quarantine tank. And they actually uh, did great in the quarantine tank, uh, except the um, yellow clown goby at some point um, died in there. Maybe it was too much cupramine or whatever, but the spots did go away on the Citron Clown Gobi and I did move him back in to the um, Project Pico where he developed the spots again and I kind of, you know, freaked out and one morning when I was leaving, I just decided to throw him back in the quarantine, not acclimating him or anything and when I came back he was dead. So it was kind of my mistake. Um, I made a huge mistake, huge, um, you know, a bad judgment call by um, throwing him back in there the way I did. I should have taken the time to acclimate him. So, you know, that's all on me. And um, so what I've done here is I've taken out all the creatures. I've taken out the sexy shrimp. I'm moving them over to um, Project Nano right now. Actually, they're probably going to stay there. And... Um, I've moved uh, the Sally Lightfoot uh, crab over to Project Natural, uh, so it's acclimating right now. And um, basically, this one, other than the um, copepods and other creatures in there, um, like the bristle worms, is going to be uh, pretty much empty. Uh, I'm going to take the, the live rock out, at least the uh, three pieces that are uh, mobile, and um, do some cleaning on them. Get some of the algae off. You can see uh, there's real bad algae on that stone. And then I'm going to um, possibly do some uh, maybe uh, new scaping just to... Um, I don't know get the layout right so I'm gonna drop a lot of water in here and I'll probably end up losing um, some of the copepods maybe they'll survive maybe they won't but um, you know that's not a big deal but I, I, I did move everything else out I don't think there's any Nassario snails in here um, I'll double check uh, the sand to make sure so um, you know that's kind of where we're at right now is uh, Project Pico really needs an overhaul and I got some time this weekend um, to work on it actually today specifically so um, you know I'll uh, upload this update and once everything is done I will film another update so uh, thank you for watching and please subscribe